offering a great balance of performance, weight, and price, the Marmot Catalyst two-person tent is easy to set up. It's got all the features you need, and it's got plenty of room for two backpackers or one camper who's looking for a little extra space. Now, the first thing that struck me about this tent uh, was the setup and kind of the pole design here. So you have a traditional freestanding tent with two doors, two vestibules, so you've got plenty of space for those two backpackers to store your gear. Because of the two doors, it's easy to get in and out of it. Uh, but as you can see, the door here in the front and the canopy here is all mesh. The door in the back and the canopy on the back of the tent is more of a taffeta material, so that gives privacy. That also gives a little bit more protection from the weather. Uh, so you've got those two materials there. The bathtub style floor on the bottom is seam taped, it's fully waterproof, so you're protected there. And it even comes with an included footprint, which adds a lot of value to this tent. Now the pole structure, you've got two cross poles here on the top. Those are the orange poles that cross over each other to the four corners. And then you have an interesting pole here. This is that gray pole that goes around the tent. A lot of times you'll see kind of a brow pole that goes across this way. This is a little bit of a longer pole, and this really gives a uh, dome shape to the tent. So while you've got plenty of room on the floor of the tent, this pole gives you lots of headroom above you. And it comes across here, stretches really nicely. You've got just clips on this tent, so you don't have sleeves to fumble with. Uh, basically, all you do is set up the tent and then clip uh, these clips with the poles. So it goes up really, really fast. And uh, we don't have the rain fly on it quite yet, but you've got a full coverage rain fly that's gonna give you all the protection you need. So we've got the doors rolled back so you can see how easy it is to get those doors out of the way. Uh, inside the tent, you've got plenty of room. So it's 88 inches by 53 inches, plenty of room for two backpackers. And again, with that interior height, you've got plenty of headroom. There's a couple pockets on the inside to get your gear up off the ground. So one pocket per camper. And then there is a lampshade pocket right here on this side, which just diffuses uh, the light of your headlamp. So, so you don't have that harsh light from the headlamp. It gives a really ambient light. It's a small feature, but it does make a nice difference when it's dark out and once you get inside the tent. In addition to those pockets, there's a clip, a hook right here in the middle of the tent that you can hang gear. And there's also a few gear loft loops. You can buy a gear loft separately and get gear up off the ground. We're gonna throw the rain fly on the tent and check out those features. It's easy to put the rain fly on the tent the correct way every time because of the color-coded construction here. Since this is a slightly asymmetrical tent, you do need to have the rain fly positioned in a certain way. So on the front two corners of the tent, there's a little red tab sewn onto the corners of the tent body and on the rain fly. So all you have to do is match those up and then clip everything together. Now, this is a freestanding design. It's a full coverage rain fly. So you do just need to stake out the front of the vestibule. And if it's a warmer day or you want more ventilation with the tent, there are two uh, tabs on either side of the tent there on the bottom of the rain fly. So you can really pull that rain fly out and have some cross ventilation coming up uh, through the tent. You can roll back each side of the vestibule here. So I've just got this side rolled back. You can see the ventilation. If you've got a nice sunny day like today, you can roll back the other side and the back of the tent too, just to have all the ventilation you need. But this rain fly is nice and durable. All the seams are taped. It's completely waterproof, so you're covered there. You have a storm flap in front of the zipper, and you even have a two-way zipper here on the front of the vestibule. So you can vent a little bit if you just pull that zipper down a little bit, if you've got everything all zipped up. With all the features that you get here, You've got a nice lightweight backpacking tent. It comes in at a really affordable price and it weighs right around five pounds. So definitely a backpacking option for one camper or two backpackers who are going lightweight. It's the Marmot Catalyst two-person tent.